Hi everyone, I'm the Reluctant Reviewer and I'm here with another review. This is a review of Spring Unsprung Lizzie Hearts. Lizzie Hearts comes in a set in a box. It is an adorable box. It's plastic and the background is so darling. It shows uh, the little um, watering hole. It shows the oh the carnival for the spring unsprung. Here's the uh, the ribbons in the trees because they were going to do like a, a maypole tree. It is really pretty. Makes you kind of think of what spring unsprung is for them. Um, I adore this. This is really cool because I love her playset. We're going to assume this is her room. Um, this shows her vanity, her dresser. Here's a nice little mirror. Probably not quite a magic mirror. She has a place to hang her purse. She has a little treasure box, which I'm assuming that you put her little card inside. But I did try that, and I had to uh, be careful trying to get it back out. So it's a little snug in there, but if you shake it you can get it back out so this is the uh, wonderland cards that lizzie always keeps hidden in her room um, it has this cute little card thing up here that you can spin i just love that it has a place that you can hook lizzie so you can just stand her right there and then it has um, more little places things uh room to put her shoes her books Another place you can put her purse in here. I just love this spin this around. I think it's so cute. And then a drawer here, um, which is your typical Mattel little drawer, um, like in the dream house, that you can just stick a whole bunch of things in and hide them. Um, she comes with a ring, uh, just like Cedar does. This is Cedar's. I'm not sure what it looks like because I got the doll secondhand, but the ring didn't come with her, so I don't know where it is. Cupid doesn't know where it is. Show you a picture. But we can show you a picture. There you go, because she does have a picture of it. So when she finds it, hmm, maybe it'll come back, maybe not. Um, but it is really a colorful place that I just adore that, and I adore that she can just peek out. It's so cute. Really, I know it's a little pricey in the stores. Try to find a sale or a coupon deal because it's really kind of cool. Or if you have a Mattel outlet, maybe they have it on discount. It is just adorable, and it has the little... Um, Ever After High Tag hanging from it. In the Ever After line, it's kind of nice that they do have varying sizes. On this one, you'll see she just wears a, a cute little dress frock with a, um, a bunch of flowers on it um, in keeping with the Spring Unsprung mode. She has a headband, just like Cedar has a headband. So you can see these are two Spring Unsprung dolls. Um, she doesn't have those cool boots that Cedar has, but she does have a nice pair of red high heels that have roses on them. She's wearing a bracelet. She also has one of these plasticky kind of flower things on her, just like Cedar does. Um, she has a little bit of red in her highlight, red and pink. Not much, just a little bit. Her hair is pulled back in a very simple setting. She has really dark red lipstick. And if you look at a first gen Lizzie, I mean that one, you get the pomp and circumstance. You get the curl in the back with the crown, a lot more red highlights. Interesting, this Lizzie does not have earrings. I thought that was interesting. Um, but she does wear another really cool pair of boots. I do like her royal outfit. It is adorable and it has this big plastic cowl on it and a big heart um, purse that is not functional, but it looks kind of cool. I mean, the blacks, the blacks and the reds, they are really kind of neat on her. Now, if you look at these two, she is the very light painted heart on her eyes, and this one has darker. I really prefer the lighter, but I don't know if that's just how they screen printed it or if it was like a major conscious decision, let's make that a little lighter or not and let's make this one more bolder. But um, maybe they made it bolder because they did make the lipstick bolder. So this one is red and this one is more maroon. Really cool. She's got a bracelet on. The only thing different you have on this one is that you don't have that painted black hand, that molded black hand you have just a natural color hand. So if you like that, I kind of like her to have her gloves on all the time. But she's really cute. Now when you look at her height, there's my friend. You can tell that she is really short. But she's short and she packs so much power in her little tiny body because if you're gonna say off with your heads for eternity, 
you better be loud and noisy and not let people know that you're really short. You have to command. So I really do like her. Please, I'll put you back. Interesting side note, um, as, uh, as Cedar has a ring, and she came with a ring, and her first edition also came with a ring, it looks like Lizzie doesn't have a ring because in her first edition she's wearing um, the black molded hands, the gloves, so she doesn't have a ring there. And the second edition, Spring Unsprung, doesn't show a ring either. We're, so, um, it looks like she doesn't come with a ring. But that's less for me to lose. This is her purse. It's pretty simple. It does not open. It's also another non-opening purse. Um, so, I do like the Lizzie coloring. I like the Lizzie idea of the story. And I like that Lizzie helped make um, Cedar's dress because she was feeling homesick for Wonderland and Spring on Sprung has a very Wonderland feel to it. So I like it that it's a way of keeping her involved in the whole festivities. Um, what do you have? Which one do you like? I like them both. I do think on the series too, they do, their face looks a little bit different. Now this one looks a little more flatter and wider than the first generation. I like them both, but it gives you some little difference in there. So maybe you haven't noticed it. Look at your dolls and see if you can. Um, that's it. Um, it's an adorable playset. Find one really cheap. It's a nice little display piece and you can take lots of pictures. So I'm going to talk to you later. Um, have fun and I'll see you. Bye.